This is Sandeep Kohl. Today, uh, you might be seeing on my screen that I have this uh, Windows 11 environment look like. But in actual scenario, this is not a Windows 11 system. So this is a Linux based system. But the interface uh, has been designed in such a way that it will look like an Windows 11 system. So today, what I will do, I will show you its installation as well as we have an overview of the features of this particular system. So you might um, use it in future because we are all uh, used to Windows environment. So this environment gives us a feel of uh, Windows. You can see if you click on this console, it opens the, uh, you know, an interface which looks like more like a uh, Windows 11 environment. So let's see. it. So we will start the installation. So what I have done, I have loaded this on my uh, virtual box environment, as you can see from the screen. And you can also try it on your VMware or virtual box, or uh, you can try it on your uh, machine itself by creating a uh, bootable USB. Now, this is the first step. Let me go to the next. So you have to select here the location. It is quite easy. Uh, just a minute, let me select my location, which is Dubai. Here we go. Uh, there is some issue with the interface, I think, that the yeah, I need to just expand this window so that I can change my language. Yeah, this might be an issue with my system because I have loaded it on virtual box. So let me put something like this. Uh, I, will, I will go with English. So let me select that language. Okay, this is okay with for me. Then I will say next. Then it will take the keyword uh, you have. You can see if you, it is presenting your keyboard and you can check it. I'll go with the default option. Now let me see what it will do. Okay, this is a you know generic uh, for any uh, Linux installation. It'll ask you whether you want to erase disk or you want to manually do the parts thing. I will say erase disk because I'm using a virtual box, so it's okay for me. So what I will do. Um, I will say next. I will give my login name. Then I will put my password. Sorry, I will key in my password. Then I will say install. So you know, this is just three, four steps and the installation has begun. So now it will uh, install the components. So okay, it's, it's all done, the installation. Has